When we take a look at the endpoints of metastatic breast cancer, really the two most talked about endpoints right now are overall survival and progression-free survival. Uh, progression-free survival is an endpoint that is um, that is marred by uh, biases, is marred by um, by interim endpoint, and and at many times it may not give the complete picture of um, how these patients are going to do long term, and it's generally considered to be substandard compared to overall survival. And overall survival has always been considered the gold standard if it can actually truly impact the survival of our patients. Um, that is very meaningful as long as it clinically as long as it's clinically meaningful improvement in overall survival. The challenge with overall survival as an endpoint is that when we take a look at overall survival, it basically tells us is a patient alive or has the patient passed away. And we take a look at PFS, has the patient progressed or not? But the journey in between the PFS and overall survival, what we term the post-progression survival, is also a very important journey. And what this uh, research was, are we capturing that journey as to what happens to the patient between progression-free survival to overall survival, a post-progression survival. So our conclusion is that just looking at overall survival on its own is incomplete. We have to take a look at the whole journey and also focus on the post-progression survival.